It's time to talk PFL playoffs with living legend Randy Couture. Let's rip through the men's welterweight quarterfinal. John Howard versus David Michaud. What do you like about this one? Well, John Howard's going off an impressive knockout at Ray Cooper. He's got great power. He's a, he's a veteran. He's fighting a relative newcomer in, in David Michaud. Uh, he's got a great wrestling background from San Diego State. He's really starting to get his feet under him, but he's going to have his hands full with John Howard. Both guys have great power, so you never know what's going to happen. So what do you expect when Sada Busi faces Ray Cooper the third? Well, a very interesting matchup because Sada Busi is six foot two at 170. He's long, he's rangy, he's got a very interesting striking style, but he's also got some great submission. You know Cooper brings great power in both hands. It's really going to be who can Get into that proper range and land that shot. It's going to be a really interesting matchup. All right, Magomed, Magomed Kurimov clashes with Chris Curtis. You see this playing out how? Magomed Kurimov is, is our returning champ. He's had a target on his back all year, but he's backed it up. He's had some great fights. This is a rematch from the regular season. Curtis lost in, in a decision in the regular season. So he's hungry. I think that the onus is always on the guy that won the first fight. What's he going to do different? What's that guy going to come in and change to get the outcome that he wants? And it's always a, a wild guess as to what that's going to be. So going to be Curtis is hungry. It's going to be an interesting fight. How big of an advantage does top seek Lyko Francois have on Andre Fialio? Well, I think Andre Fialio is going to settle into this and have a full camp walking into that, this fight, which is a good thing for him. He took his first fight in the regular season on 10 days notice. He got a walkover in his second fight to secure the number eight seed. Franza is coming off of two finishes in, in his regular season bouts. He secured the number one seed with, with those, those performances. So he's coming in with a full head of steam. It's going to be an interesting matchup. He can make a case for either guy to win this fight. But uh, Franza is probably the favorite after his regular season performance. All right, people, watch it all go down on ESPN2 and ESPN+. Plus.